What's up world, Mr. Magnaragnarok here, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. In the last video, we beat Tubba Blubba and rescued our third star spirit. In this video, we're going to save and continue and see what Princess Peach is up to. And here is Princess Peach and Twink, yet again. I wonder how Mario's doing. Do you think he found a way to beat that Tubba Blubba? I wonder too. I'm so worried. What if Mario got hurt? Well, um, no use wondering. Why don't we go out and try to eavesdrop again? If Mario managed to beat Tubba Blubba by now, Bowser and his followers will be really, really mad, don't you think? You may be right, Twink. There's no use just sitting around worrying like this. Let's see what we can find out. Alright, well, let us go exploring. To at least to an extent, anyways. Alright, push the button. Nothing can go wrong, right viewers? Well, it can actually. It can't be! No, no, no! Explain that again slowly. Your wretchedness, I keep trying to tell you. Tubba Blubba was mm, defeated by Mario. Well, that's strange because you told me he was invincible. How can you, how can you beat someone who's invincible? I like his stomping animation. Grr, stupid Mario. I guess maybe he found out the secret that made Tubble Blubba not quite so invincible. And then he beat him. Gah! I despise Mario. Really? Your filthiness. We have to come up with another tactic and quickly. Mario will most likely go to Shy Guy's toy box next. Yes, yeah, so we should prepare something there for his arrival. I won't be satisfied with just having him beaten up anyone anymore. What we need to do is find his weak point and completely humiliate him. Yeah! Can we Koopa? You've gotta find out what Mario hates and... Oh. Gah! For the love of why, why is Princess Peach here? What's wrong with those guards? No, wait, hang on. This is... Actually, good timing, my mischievous princess. We're just discussing the weak points of our mutual friend Mario. So, Princess Peach, what do you know about his weaknesses, huh? And listen, you must be honest. Which one of these things does Mario hate the most? Now, whatever you choose, this will basically decide. That basically, Kami Koopa is gonna set these traps in the next chapter. And basically, that's when Mario's gonna come and handle those traps. So, let's say Mushroom. Mm, I see, excellent. Is there another thing that fills him with dread? Buzzy, Hammer Rose, which we haven't met as an enemy yet. Or Thunder Rage. Let's say Thunder Rage. Good, good. And how about these things? Which of these does he hate? A Pokey, Koopa Troll, again, we haven't met these enemies. And a Super Soda, so let's say Super Soda. Oh, excellent. Perfect. Thanks, Princess. <laughs> Be sure Mario can't avoid these things that he hates. We'll beat him for sure. Did you get all that, Kimmy Koopa? Get going immediately. <laughs> oh, of course, your gnarliness. Mario is really in for now, or is he? Hmm, I started to wonder for a second there. But then again, King Bowser orders this, so I have no choice but to obey him. I guess we'll see. Of course you will. My tactics are brilliant. They're pure art. So, Kemi Koopa, have Princess Peach taken back to her room immediately. Finally, we will witness the end of Mario at last. <laughs> Guards, attention. Take Princess Peach back to her room at once. Yes, ma'am. No, not again. Why does Twink look so sad? It's not like those Koopa Trolls are gonna do anything bad to her. At least I don't think. Or at least Bowser won't allow it. Hello again, Mario. I knew you could do it. I don't know how to thank you. I knew it was the right decision to ask you to help us. You're a great man. Now that I'm free, I can help you. Ha! And we get a new Star Spirit power, and this one is probably the most 
common one I'll be using for the rest of the game, viewers. Or your star energy goes up to three. Or you can now use Star Swarm, a new star spirit power. With Star Swarm, you can attack all enemies. Mario, I have one bit of bad news. Unfortunately, Bowser's life force seems to be getting stronger all the time. Most likely, it's the Star Rod that's giving him more power. We're not even sure if he's noticing it or not, but there's no question that it's making him stronger than before. We will have to be much more careful in the coming trials. Ah, I'm sorry to leave, but I must go back to Star Haven. The other Star Spirits are waiting for me there. Oh, and if you could, please keep it a secret that I got lost in Forever Force. Thanks, Mario. Bye. I'm not gonna keep that secret. Anyways. Is there anything over here? Like, is there a hidden panel? Because I have a feeling there is. Oh wow, I never noticed this before, but if you go back here, you can actually see a much better clear view of the windmill. I actually never noticed that. Huh. Well, now I know. And knowing is half the battle. Okay, well, let us head back to Toad Town. Use this heart block while I'm at it. Not like I need it, but I'm just gonna use it anyways just to be beneficial. Oh, ooh, ooh, actually, actually, wait, 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 wait. Uh. I literally do have a feeling there's a star panel somewhere here. Eh. I might be imagining it, but anyways, let us go. No, wow, ah, bugs, get him off me! I'm lost in a freaky forest. This is so scared. Eek! Oh, Mario! Oh, thank. I mean, aha! Boy, are you unlucky to run into me again? Who's this kid? What a dirty little urchin! He must be lost. Hey, shut up! Shut up! I'm not a lost child. I'm your worst nightmare. Here comes the pain. Alright, this is the... Third? Third or... Yeah, this is the third fight against Junior Troopa. Don't think I'm as vulnerable as I was before. Check this out. More power! Oh, you have wings. Aha, yeah, that's right. Let's see how you like this new and improved Junior Tr Koopa. That's a Koopa. Typo. Okay. Well, our hammer is useless, but our hammer throw isn't. Before I do, I want to change to Goom. I am an Artard, viewers. I am an Artard. Yeah, as you can tell, he's got five attack power, but I don't know exactly how much HP he has, which I'm trying to find out. Max HP is 40, and he's got one defense point. Okay. Alright, well, at least I know now. And again, knowing's half the battle. There's the timing again on his attack, if you didn't remember, viewers. Let's go to Park Carry. Eh, pretty lucky badge. going to die. Alright. 
right. One more shell shot. All right. Ordinary jump and one more shell shot should do it. Yay, you've been killed. 21 star points, and I thought that spell was gonna kick in there, but it didn't. Oh well. No, darn it, darn it, darn it! Alright, and just take all the wrong paths as possible, viewers, and you'll be out of the forest in no time. Is it? Toe Town, yes, we are back. How are we looking on time? Good God, 11 minutes? Oh, I made it out of the forest. I could kiss the ground. Yeah, <laughs> He's glad to be out of there. Safe point right there if you need it. I don't. And the music has changed all of a sudden. But now that we have ground pound, we can do this. Star piece. Oh, 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 no! My favorite frying pan! <gasps> you stole Taste T's frying pan! Technically, we haven't mess met Taste T yet, but... We will here very, very soon, viewers. There's a shy guy. Look at this jackass. Yeah, you better run. Yes, okay. There's the star piece. I had a really, really, really good feeling it was going to be right there. Alright, let's head this way. We haven't been over here on this part of town yet. Mario! Mario, Mario, good to see you. We found, we found out that you defeated Tubba Blubba. I knew you could do it. I just knew it. When we heard the news, the princess was very relieved. Oh yes, I've got new information about the Honorable Star Spirits who are still in prison. Have you ever heard of Shy Guy's Toy Box? It seems that one of the Honorable Star Spirits is being held there. But where on earth is Shy Guy's Toy Box? I have no idea. And Twink's shadow is suddenly in midair. Oh, time is short. I have to go back to Princess now. Good luck, Mario. Princess Peach and I are always cheering on you on. Hey, look at this guy. Yo, little man named Shet Rippo. Pleasure meeting you. Say, man, don't you want to upgrade your status? <laughs> yeah, I know you do. It's usually 390 coins, but you, and only you, I'll do it for just 39. If you give me 39 coins, I'll upgrade your HP, FP, or BP. Not living or cheating on you. No, you want it. Now, we could upgrade it, but I don't want to, because if you do, you're going to have to lower one of your other stats in order to do so. Star piece in here? I thought there was. I guess not. Uh, no, we do not want to go here just yet. Here at the docks. Might as well get this out of the way while I'm here. This isn't where we're supposed to be, but might as well get coins galore. Save point right there if you want it. I don't. All right, let's head down this way. Let's head back this way.
Head up here. Hey, you, you little scam. Get your hands off. Give me back my calculator. You stole Rolf's calculator. Rolf is confused. Sorry, bud. I had to close up the shop. Some idiot shy guy stole my calculator. You believe that? I need that thing to calculate sales, bud. I'm not a genius when I find that little punk. Out of here. Oh, thank you. The flowers give you their thanks as well, Mario. No problem. Oh, hey, Merlin's out of his house. Oh, it's you, Mario. What fortunate timing. Hmm, the town seems to be pretty active today, but it's none of my concern. I had a dream last night, and another oracle spoke to me. Its voice was heavenly. If you keep going around and around the red palm tree in the distant desert town dry dry outposts, something good will happen. So said the voice of my dream. It doesn't seem to make any sense at all to me. Back thinking about it makes me so uneasy that I can't sleep at night. If you find out what it means, please tell me. Where where in the world do you even sleep at all? Alright, let's head this way. Now we may be able to un we may unable be unable to get badges from Rolf's shop. However, we are still able to Get badges here at Merlo's place. And I know for a fact there's a star piece around here. Yep, right here. Okay, so let's go and talk to Merlo. See what all badges we can get. Yes, yes, you're the famous Merlot. So, let's see. I want... Well, now, there's only three badges he has that I need. I need Feeling Fine, Peekaboo, and Zap Tab, meaning I need a total of 25 star pieces. So, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to get Peekaboo, so I will no longer need to use Goombario's Tattle. Oh, it costs 3 BP to use it? Good God. Alright, well, peekaboo badge is somewhat worth it. And I will go ahead and get the feeling fine badge as well. 3 BP. Alright, well, I don't have any more star pieces, so I can't buy any more badges for me. Good god, 3 BP? Um... You know what, I'll just wait till my next BP level up, and then I'll use it then. Alright, well, let's head back to Toad Town, since there's not really much we can do right now. And, let me think, is there really, well actually I never went over here to this part of Toad Town yet, so let's check over here real quick. Ah, words are monkey me, I need that dictionary. Aww. There's a star piece right over there. We can't get it just yet, but we will soon in the future, viewers. Oh, wait, um, one more thing. One more thing. Jackie Chan Adventures was a good show. Get out of here. Oh no, poor me. Get out of here. 
Mario, way to show that little hooligan a thing or two. Hooray, thank you so much. I'm still giving great deals at rock bottom prices, so don't be a stranger around here. I will actually buy your fire flower. Okay, and... There is another thing I want to do, but... Let me see, how are we looking on time? 20 minutes. Yeah, you know what, I'll just save this for the next video. So, we're gonna end things off here. So next time on Let's Play Paper Mario, we will go into the Toe Town Tunnels. Alright, see you guys then.